Hey guys, thanks for watching Precision Rifle Network. Today I have three new products to show you. I have this thing, and this thing, and I also have this thing. Let's get into it, and I'll tell you all about these three cool new products. All right, guys, so the first product we're gonna talk about is the Atlas Tensioning Wrench made by Victor Company USA. So you're all familiar with this piece of kit right here. The Atlas Bipods are some of the toughest and best on the market. Many, many of us use it. The problem with this um, is that sometimes when you tighten down this thumb wheel, you still are able to cant your rifle or there's enough recoil in your rifle to uh, make the rifle cant upon recoil. What you really need to be able to do is get this thing just a little bit tighter sometimes so that it completely eliminates the movement from the system. But it's really hard to do that with just your fingers. So, Victor Company USA has come up with the Atlas Tensioning Wrench. Now you notice a, a shape here. They actually make three different wrenches to accommodate the different uh, model of Atlas uh, bipod that you have. It's really simple. Uh, you've already figured this out by now. You can just place it over the top of your wheel and you can give it that little extra. So no more canting of your Atlas bipod after you've used one of these little wrenches. Pretty nice and handy, lightweight. MSRP is $39.99. You can find them on their website. I will link it below. All right, guys, and the next product I have for you is the Task by Trost. All right, now this thing is pretty cool. Looks like just a simple cup holder. There's actually quite a bit more to it. Obviously, it's a cup holder, right? Your, your big thermos bottles, uh, like from Yeti, or like a one liter Nalgene bottle will fit nicely right into there. It's also got this Velcro, you know, or hook and loop, uh, two inch strip all the way around it so you can put morale patches on there if you'd like. You've got pen holders. Um, I believe you can hold six different pens on it. Um, you've got Velcro again along here. These buckles, the buckles are all metal. That's a pretty great feature to have those metals so you can put some weight in there and they won't, uh, they won't break on you. Grommets for attaching things. The straps are reinforced with great stitching and they're also rubberized on the inside so it won't slide down on your tripod. Obviously got a, a cinch strap up here on top Okay, um, to close this up, say you wanna just put your keys in there or your cell phone or something like that when you're on the range, you can cinch that right up. But down inside of there, right at about, oh, this line right in here, there's another cinch strap in there. So you could, um, you could close that off. You could put something in the bottom like your keys and then close that off. And then you could put like a pop can or something like that in on top, it becomes the right height. Secures some of your valuables down in the bottom. So even if this gets tipped over, you're not gonna lose your stuff. So then down here on the bottom, we do have a reinforced loop where you can hook a carabiner. And then of course you could put your, uh, your backpack or something like that on the bottom of there and still pull weight down on the bottom of your backpack, which a lot of us like to do to give our, uh, our things some stability. So these are a really nice piece of kit. Uh, prepare yourself for a little bit of sticker shock when you check them out. You can find them on Mile High Shooting's website. The MSRP on these is $149, but to me, well worth it. It's the, it's the piece of kit that I've kind of been missing when I'm standing behind my glass for long periods of time. Uh, I really like it, so check that out, guys. All right, guys, and the last piece of kit here, I'm not gonna do a full install video on it. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and show you where it goes, and I'm gonna install it, and then I'll show it to you afterwards, but it is a thumb rest for the AIAT rifles. So it replaces just this side on your, uh, your quick disconnect. And then this is actually just a removable uh, button that you can push out. So this thumb rest is gonna mount right in there so we can get our, our thumb rested right along the, the side like most of us like to do uh, in competition. So let me go ahead and get this installed and then I'll show you afterwards. I'm 
All right guys, so now as you can see, I've got a permanently attached thumb rest on my I, AI. <laughs> I can't say AI today, it's driving me nuts. It's simple, A-I-A-T, I should be able to say that, right? Now I have attached permanently a thumb rest to my A-I-A-T rifle, got it, yes. All right, so now that we've got that uh, that hard part of speaking out of the way, guys, I think this is great, you know? Um, I took a class from Frank Galley uh, out in Colorado <clears throat> recently, right after I had purchased this gun, and I was farting around with this trigger finger trying to figure out the proper placement to get my good 90 degree trigger press, and um, turns out really all I was missing was this thumb rest because I've got it on all my other guns. So um, now that I've got this permanently attached, I've got my, uh, my good trigger press uh, alignment, and um, I just think that's a nice, simple piece of kit. You are giving up your um, your flush cup on the strong side of your of your rifle, but you've still got it on the off side and back on the buttstock. You have them on both sides too. So uh, for an MSRP of thirty nine ninety nine, you can find that from Anarchy Outdoors. I think that's a great little kit, guys. Thanks for watching Precision Rifle Network today. Tune in again soon for another great video.